Welcome to Dust Off the Bricks. We've got a few uh, <clears throat> Lego City sets here. We've got the 60389, the custom car garage with 507 pieces, the mobile police dog training with 197 pieces, fire rescue, fire rescue and police chase, 60319 with 295 pieces. We've got this little uh, vet van rescue with 58 pieces, set number 60382. <clears throat> and this little poly bag, um, 30370 Ocean Diver with 22 pieces. So just a few little city sets here. <clears throat> Not a massive haul, but just a little one. So uh, this one I just picked up, it was 50% off. Um, the cars are actually pretty cool looking. Um, not big into Lego cars just because I've had so many of them. Uh, but this one actually looks pretty cool. And it comes with like these transparent uh, light blue pieces, which are very good for mocks. But uh, other than that, oh, and I did no stickers on this one because, uh, I don't know, I just felt like I wasn't going to keep this together for very long. So I figured I just uh, wouldn't put any stickers on. I think this is the first uh, city set that I haven't put uh, stickers on. But, like, these pieces are nice, and they had, like, flames on, and I was like, I would never use that in a mock. So, but, yeah, pretty cool-looking cars. Kind of outlandish cars, too. <clears throat> so, very, uh, custom cars, I would say. But, uh, what is cool is these pop off. Let's see if I can do it one-handed. Oh, without breaking it. Let's try this car. That might be a little bit easier. Whoa. Well, uh, took out some people, but, uh, so these, like, the bumpers come off, and then you can add different bumpers on. They just clip on. So, uh, it does it in the front and the back, so, um, so that there, I believe, is the front of a car, front of a car, back of a car, and then obviously the back of the car just took off. And it kind of is nice how they have this little, these little stands here to hold everything. And I will say, though, like, this should be moved to here because um when you put the cars up here to work on them they just roll off the front so uh maybe there's it's, oh i see in the picture they're supposed to be like this they're not supposed to be all the way on but yeah so few uh new pieces for this uh at least for me so you get uh where did she go did she fly away oh no she's over here so you get this uh, welding mask, so that's pretty cool. Um, and then one of the cars, the backs of them, uh, has a new element for me. Let's see which one it is. I can't find it anywhere. Um, but it's like a bracket, snot bracket, that goes all the way, that's six wide. I can't find it anywhere. But uh, other than that, it just comes with a... Nothing too special for pieces wise, honestly. Uh, you get these black uh, wide window or uh, door frame pieces or window frame pieces. Uh, you get this piece, which I would say isn't super common. Um, but you get four minifigures. Um, sh this lady here comes with pink hair as well, and she's supposed to be in the wheelchair. Then you get some maintenance workers and two drivers. So, and you get a uh, hair for all the drivers too. There should be another hair piece somewhere. Probably flew away when that car went flying. But yeah. Then also you get extra engines to put into the cars. So you can take off, at least with this car, you can take this off, pop this out, and put a different engine in it. And then you also get this one as well. So, lots of uh, customization for sure. Uses a little uh, um, binocular piece for the blower. So, but yeah, it's uh, pretty interesting. Definitely not going to stay together for long. Oh, and then over here, um, there's supposed to be sticker elements here. Like, the you can switch, like, that's the car. Then you turn this, and that's the back of the car we're going to do. And you can turn this piece up, and that's the other, or that's the front of the car we're going to do. So, pretty cool, honestly, like, playable features. Oh, and then you get this toolbox. Comes with a bunch of tools on it and stuff. 
So I'm guessing that piece is for the, um, to put the welding mask on or helmet on. So there, yep. Or a race car helmet, it looks like. Because in the picture, there's a race car helmet. So yeah, um, all together, it's a, I would say it's a pretty good set. It's not something uh, I would I was not planning on picking up, but it was $30. So price per piece was pretty good. Usually I would need it to be more than that if I wasn't exactly interested in it. But uh, the thing that really got me was the welding helmet. Honestly, I um, didn't have one. So uh, yeah, and other than that, uh, nothing really spiked my interest. But yeah, so let's move on to the mobile dog training. This one, I'll tell you what spiked my interest on this one. If anybody watches my channel regularly... You know, I'm always trying to get the new molded animals. So and it fin we finally got our molded Lego puppy, German Shepherd puppy. So pretty uh, awesome. And, uh, and you get a little trailer here, a little car. Um, the back flips up to store the dogs in for training purposes. Um, you get a little flashlight on the side, a shovel. You get uh, two um, minifigures and two animals. So th and also what's actually spiked my interest with this one is this uh, um, suit, the dog suit. So these are the old cactus arms from the CMF, and they made it in um, blue to imitate a dog bite suit. So that was pretty cool, too. Um... And then uh, you just get this little teeter-totter, this little thing. You get some dog doo-doo. Um, and then this little thing to jump over. So all together, it's honestly what you get is a pretty good set. And I love this trailer. You get the 6x6 plate that goes on it. Um, here's the hair for the officer who's wearing the suit back there. Um, just all together, pretty uh, solid set. Um, I love the trailer. Um, but I'm guessing... What you do is you take these off because they're not held together by very many studs and then you can store them in the back of that and then you just yeah so you can go and train anywhere you want so as you can see in the pictures oh i also like these things these little dog carrier or leashes things i don't have very many of them so it's nice to pick up an another one but yeah nothing that's the only new element that i got in the set that i believe um, I purchased this set quite a little while ago, and it's just been waiting to do a review on it, waiting for a few more city sets. But yeah, that's uh, the mobile police training, dog training. All right, and now for the fire rescue and police chase. It's a little older set from 2022. And you get a car. I think these pieces in this car will be nice, the 2x6 pieces, but it is a pretty nice simple looking car then you have the fire vehicle and of course you have a drone because you know you don't have enough fire drones and it does come with a little water you push this lever on the back and it launches that trans clear splat piece and it's just a typical fire truck Nothing uh, too fancy about it. Get a fire extinguisher there. The drone. This was a uh, this was released when there's a lot of police releases in 2022. And you get this police woman with the radio, handcuffs, and her additional hair. I just stuck to the back. Then you get the bank robber. And then for the pretty much the main build. So this comes with three mini figures, a police officer, a firefighter, and a robber. And you just get a, a little fire hydrant there, a fish, a little baby cat, um, the firefighter with his uh, radio. And then this lifts up. And it's a little control panel. 
which I think is pretty nice. Uh, can be used as mocks and then also in the back there's a flame piece so you can launch that drone splat piece at the fire and make it disappear and then you also have a traffic light right here so pretty uh pretty cool build i mean it comes with some good pieces for mocks i uh, got this on significant sale i ended up picking up two of them but yeah all right now for the <laughs> the Vet Van Rescue. I mean, there's nothing much here. You get a cat, you get a dog, you get too many figures. So honestly, for um, the size of a set, you get a decent amount. Uh, the cat looks a little darker in the picture than it does here, but you get a great cat with a little stretcher type thing. You get a little bulldog looking dog. You get a bull with a treat and a bone on it. Then you get one of the vets with a syringe and a bottle. This is four plus, I will say that. Then you get another vet. And then the vet van, um, it's a four plus set. That's all I'm gonna say. This is a nice piece though. Um, but yeah, this comes back, drops back so you can put the stretcher in there with the animal how does this go in it's in here somehow there we go i was just missing completely because i'm looking through the camera yeah so it uh, fits right in there and this transparent piece is honestly the only piece that i can really see me using mocks no sticker elements because it is four plus all right and now for this poly bag the ocean diver 22 pieces honestly two or one minifigure one uh stingray or whatever you want to call it and a simple build and a little jet thingy um it's honestly pretty good for uh i think it's seven bucks and you get both those um i would say that's pretty good for a minifigure and a animal a uh, pretty large animal too not just like a cat or a dog um so honestly that's a i think a steal of a deal um, and you get one of these pieces as well. So if I ever do an underwater scene, I'll have plenty of those. But yeah, that's, uh, that's my Lego City Hall. Um, pretty good sets. Only one that I'm not honestly very fond of is that one. But, um, it has great pieces. got great price per piece. So I'll, when I take it apart, um, all you can use those pieces. And I got a couple new pieces. So other than that, these are all pretty solid sets. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.